Hello, beautiful people. Welcome to Global Happenings today. Um, when it when it comes to the issue of Southeast, the issue of uh, Biafra actualization, Igbo presidency, Mazen Namdekanu seem to take the center stage of it all. Uh, right now, um, the apex social cultural group of, of the Southeasterners are beginning to talk. In fact, they have laid fresh claims and fresh demand at the table of uh, the president, and they're making their demands in very strong ways. But before we go into the newspaper to find out exactly these fresh demands they're laying before the president, we'd like you to subscribe to our channel if you have not done so already by clicking on the red subscribe button beside it. You will see a bell notification icon. Please go ahead, click on it to get notified as soon as we update our channel on YouTube. Let's go straight into the news. The Igbo Social Cultural Group. Ohane Zendibo has demanded a political solution be deployed in resolving the issues and matters of the 10th leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB, that's Mazen Namdekana. The president general of the group, that's George Obiozo, while making a case for Biafra agitator, said if the federal government can grant or could grant amnesty to rep repentant Boko Haram, Boko Haramist and the Ninja Delta militant, there's nothing stopping it from considering the case of Kano. Speaking on Thursday during an interview on channels television, Obiozo argued that the Igbo people are not at war with the rest of the of the country, with the rest of Nigeria, urging the president, President Muhammad Buhari, to reconsider his stand not to release the detained indigenous people of Biafra leader, that's Namde Kano. He said, Namde Kano, who is currently facing charges bordering on treasonable felony and terrorism, deserves to be given another chance and forgiven as force is as dangerous, is a dangerous option for everyone. Recall that the president, President Muhammad Buhari, has shattered the hope of some individuals that he might release Namde Kano. Speaking in, in in an interview with Channel's Television, Ed Wednesday, Buhari asked the pro Biafran agitator to defend himself in court for spreading false information about Nigeria when he was in the United Kingdom. This is coming after a, a former Minister of Aviation, Mbazuliki Amechi, led some Igbo leaders to visit the president for, unconditional, for the unconditional release of the indigenous people of Biafran leader, on November 19, 2021. But Buhari had during the visit told the delegation that he would not want to interfere in the running of the judiciary, but said he would consider their heavy demand. Asked on Thursday night to react to the latest declaration by the president, Ohane Zendibo leader urged Buhari to consider a political solution in Kanu's case, saying the move would de-escalate the tension in the southeast region. We I quote him, we in Igbo land have made it categorically clear that we prefer a political solution to it, a dialogue, a dialogue to end it. It is clear to the rest of Nigeria, Obioza said, and we have repeatedly said that Igbo nation is not at war with Nigeria. Therefore, what is happening can be handled. I will use the words, the words political solution as the answer. Dialogue is the answer. Just as other sections of Nigeria, some areas of Nigeria, people who behaved like Kano have, be, have been forgiven, given amnesty, and integrated into, reintegrated into the society and the country. So, what we are asking is for Mr. President to use the prerogative of mercy to look into the situation in the Southeast. The prerogative of mercy is exclusive exclusively the right of the president. We are not talking about court. We are not talking about the use of force. Use of force is dangerous for everyone, and it will definitely not solve the problem. It will make it worse. We are not new, in, we are not new to Nigerian politics. We saw in South South, Niger Delta Avengers, M-E-N-D, that's MED, and the rest, even the present Boko Haram, those who said they are repenting, how they are being rehabilitated. The problem of federalism is that the sensitivity is very much on the surface. If you don't do one as you have done others, you will have a problem. Mm. That's quite strong and it's making a lot of sense. Uh, don't forget that in some quarters, some persons would rather prefer Mazen Kano to go through the court proceedings completely so that um, uh, he, will may, he may not be called on to sign some um, compromising 
a document or, or document of some sort of sacrifice, you know, at some point if there's going to be a political solution, something has to give. Okay, we can't just give it everything to you on the platter. There's something that you have to bring to the table. What could what would that be? Would it be something that uh, Masana Mikano may or will be willing to give? And judging the fact that in this struggle for Biafra, thousands, he has quite if not millions of followers following him, and a whole lot of them believe very strongly that he would remain and focus and follow on the issue of Biafra actualization. So, uh, of course, if there's going to be a political solution, there has to be a dropping of the Biafra agitation. So you now see that it's quite a dicey one. But the question is, will Mazen and Bikalu be willing to agree to such terms? While um, Obiozo, George Obiozo, Professor George Obiozo, is of the opinion that what is good for the goose is definitely perfect good for the gander. What is good for Boko Haram? What is good for uh, Niger Delta Avengers, uh, uh, Niger Delta Militants? Should also be good for the indigenous people of Biafra, being that these guys have caused a lot of mayhem and were given amnesty. They were not just given amnesty, they were reabsorbed into the society. In some places, they were even given salaries, some sort of alawi allowances, uh, stipends that are being paid monthly. I'm talking about for the case of um, Niger Delta Group, uh, militant, Niger Delta militant. So you now see that there's a situation in our hands. And that's one of the problems or challenges of uh, federalism. If you if you have, you must go, go through equity and justice and fairness, what you have done for one region should be able to replicate it in another region. But the question now is, while um, Ohane Zendibo, Professor George Obiozo, is calling and pleading for political solution, okay, where this can be, you know, where court cases can be, you know, expunged with and look at a way of bringing him out safe and sound without the, the tension, because they, they, they need to you know, de radicalize the tension that is going on in Southeast. And come some few days to go now, you definitely hear that there will be a court hearing. There will also be a lot of things that may be expected to happen that day, which is the solidarity movement of Mazen and Mekano's court hearing cases. And of course, they have called on UN to come monitor uh, the court hearing. Now, you now see that it's a, situ- it's a situation that is quite um, a sensitive one. And Hannes and they were saying now for the unity and equity for the peace and justice of this country and the president should use his right use his um, wisdom and use his exclusive right derogative right of mercy to ensure that mass and can is released unconditionally without necessarily going to the court case but of course you don't forget that northern groups have severally rejected uh, screamed foul play in fact they they insisted that man's and can must go through the court case fully and he should be made to pay for it crimes against humanity according to them that's where we're going to wrap it up what to take do you agree with professor biozo on this issue of amnesty uh, being the prerogative right to the president to be given to master namdi and other biafran agitators or do you think master namdi should just go through uh, the court case and since he's of the opinion and his lawyers of the opinion that the government have no case against him so there may be a win-win chance in the process let's see the conversation what to take do you have